What's good, gang? It's your boy Black Genie, and today we're back with a new video, guys. Hey, gang. We back with the Jutsu no Kaisen. I'm actually excited to get into this episode. Last episode came with some heat. I'm pretty late to this, so I only have one little spoiler that I wish I didn't have, even though it's not that crazy. I always know there's gonna be a new character, y'all. I've been seeing a whole lot of thumbnails, and that's exactly where I'm gonna start getting Jutsu no Kaisen right when it gets out. So yeah, hit that like button before we get into this video. I'm hyped to see what's gonna happen, long story short, last episode. I forgot what main character name is again, bro. He ate the finger, which is crazy. And he got a demon in him now. He like a two-faced demon, you know what I mean? On some Ichigo and his hollow. Long story short, before I got into the anime, people were hyping it up like Bleach. So I kinda got this little Bleach in my head uh, with this anime comparison. And episode one kinda gave me that thing, you know what I mean? I know what they meant. But long story short, we finna get into episode two and we finna see what's up, y'all. All I can say is that uh, I know this anime finna be heat, so if you enjoy these reactions, help your boy out by hitting the like button. And if y'all want the full reaction, you can go a little extra mile and go uh, support your, pa your boy Patreon, you know what I mean? Full reaction, early reaction, right when I watch it. Uh, but I ain't gonna say too much, y'all. We finna get into the Jutsu no Kaisen, and yeah, we finna see what's up, so y'all make sure y'all stay tuned on the game. Oh, his name was Itadori. Oh, it's a user curse. Yup, this is exactly what happened last episode, and he was like, alright, we're not even starting off with the OP, but I just watched the OP. So, it's like, he's actually controlling this shit, I thought. Oh, the Curse Object, yeah. It's funny, because this was a new character I was saying. Whoa, he's a sensei? Awesome. See, I, I'm kind of like... Not remembering because I was high as fuck last episode, but I want to feel like he was probably the first nigga we seen last episode when it first started. You know what I mean? But I don't know. Sorry, but I ate it. <laughs> How's he gonna react? Wait, it's probably not him because he called him Sensei. And nigga in the first episode was looking crazy. Like he already knows the deal. Can this nigga see or is he blind? I think he's sensing it. He probably is blind. I don't know. Himself with Sukun. That's his name? I curse you eight. His, so his curse name is Sukun. Can give us 10 seconds. 10 seconds are come back to us. Don't worry, I'm the strongest. This nigga. See, I like seeing niggas like this. He a cocky fuck. Hopefully that ain't come out wrong. But he's cocky as shit, you know what I mean? He's already letting him take over. Whoa, hey, hey. The Sukano shit is tough. That shit is gonna be something that we gonna fuck with. I already know. It's a, it, hey, it's a demon in the main character. Wait, did he dodge that nigga just sit on him? Whoa, yeah, he's flash stepping on, buddy. He flash stepping on, buddy. Hey, hey. Hey, my student's watching, so I'm gonna give him a show a little bit. So I'm gonna show off a little. That's what he's saying, you know what I mean? This nigga actually, you feel me? He coming different, bro. So, so all right, Sukuna, you're a demon, but if the sensei is looking this strong, it's gonna be some crazier demons out there. Sometimes these subtitles don't come right, so I read it in my own way, guys. I already know. I like Sukuna's voice. It's tough, bro. What's he counting? Oh. Itadori can really take control of his own body when he needs to. So, the only thing that I was kind of, the only thing that I could like completely, I'm not going to compare this anime like Bleach Guy. I'm not going to do that. But Ichio can control that shit. This nigga actually doing this shit like it's like. It's my body, give it back. That's tough. So when he's actually in trouble, even though Itadori looks like he has his own curse and he could like fight for his own, when he's actually in trouble, he could just let that shit do his thing. Then he's good. Imagine she has a vessel. 
I'm pretty sure there probably there's probably other people like him that have curses in him that in them that even if he's mixed juice regulation demand except for Jesus. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's other people like this. Even if they're demanded to be executed. Just because he can control it. He's a special case, low key. Whoa! I was actually right. The recap in current. When episode one started, what they were showing us was literally this. And yeah. No wonder why he looked a little familiar, even though I didn't see him. Like. Like, I didn't pay attention on him. I've been seeing people's thumbnails. Oh, me. They're 20. I thought that's that. I think they extracted it for him. I thought they extracted that of him for a second. Oh, they're all part of the same Sak Sakuno, whatever. He just, did he just destroy it? As you can see, we destroyed them. We can't destroy. Oh. This is just that part. Oh. Oh, because they feel like the curse is just better obliterated. Right. It would. Because you're strong. And so, you know, we won again. To be honest, that's that's right. That's what I propose. We're going to get the run again. Or cooperate and find every single part, and then we'll kill you. That is crazy, y'all. I already knew that. I'm gonna put that up. All right, I'm getting the OP right now, even though I watched it right before this shit. But that is crazy. The option that they're putting for him. It's like I'm gonna have to escape after this shit or get stronger with Sakuna, and then be a real nigga. Like that's what I'm thinking. But yeah, let's get into it right now. All right, I'm hyped. You we we don't got too much longer left. Like these motherfuckers are probably gonna be under absolute observation of you. Oh, this was a bro that was in their club and shit. And they opened that shit. Didn't she see him there? Oh yeah, he did come in later after, you're right. It's funny how he's just telling them, he's just telling them the truth, you know what I mean? I really feel like he's gonna build a relationship with these guys and they're not gonna kill him even after he absorbs every piece or takes in every piece of Sakuna. This is, he actually has a suck destiny in this anime. Like, if this was just me, it's like, bruh, so I gotta throw away my life because I ate the, ate the shit. And I just gotta choose how, how, how bad I want it. Like, how long I want to survive, long story short. But at the same time, it's like, bro, if they kill him, bro, that's just really messed up. Even if all parts, if he absorbs all parts, am I, am I, am I, you still have that finger. He gonna take this shit right now? You know, you're free to skip. I feel like the more he's taking this shit, the Sukuna is gonna take more strength in him, and he's probably not gonna be able to control it like he's able to do it right now. That's sick, man. That's sick. Sheesh, sheesh, sheesh. Yo, the funny thing is that I don't even trust this nigga. Yo, like, bro, you gonna have to, bro. This nigga Itadori, nah, he's probably just he's being on guard. I know he's being on guard right now because he does he doesn't trust he might be able to hold it on. He trusted it, but not fully, you know what I mean? He's gonna put his guard down. Ha! He took it. That settles it. It's not just physical tolerance. He can control himself against the Kuno without issues. Yep. Thousands of years. Nigga, he might just know that, alright, we might let you think that you might die, but since we have not seen someone as strong as you, for this long, we're just gonna 
have to make you a good person until we can't continue, then we might kill you. That's probably what's in his head. He seems like a Kakashi type person to me. Just observing and like, you feel me? If we have to kill you, we're going to kill you. I mean, Kakashi probably not like that fully, but you know what I mean? Kind of. Oh, he's going to go to the same school as him then? Damn, there's not even a lot of them. Itadori family grave. Wait, is that like you, your father, or something like that? Oh, I see. <laughs> Who's gonna be stronger than this nigga? The fact that he was con What amazing body you have now? Oh me. Whoa It's an honor to be targeted by Sukuna. Hey the fact that this nigga can talk through his body now is crazy. That's why he could talk over his bodies and shit like that. This nigga would like even though he was probably a regular human, yeah, he had he had four arms, he had multiple eyes. Oh, he done me got the strongest curse. Who's stronger? You were. Then him, of course. Wait, how strong is you then, nigga? He's like, I don't, that's what I'm saying. I, I I know he's typing himself up. He's like, yeah, it'd be a little draining. Like, how strong is you? Like, you know what I mean? I actually want to know. I got, I got like, enemies like this got to get long enough so I could know how strong these niggas is to compare them with other enemies. You know what I mean? I hope it does get long so I can do that shit. That's the fucking Sukuna vessel, uh, we would say. <laughs> well, I don't know why this nigga asking why and shit like that when this nigga said, said bro. I mean, he literally just said he was going to ask him a bunch of questions, I say. I mean, he did say he would execute in his spot if that nigga didn't, if he wouldn't fucking come right. This nigga really doesn't have a great reason. Like, you know what I mean? He he really doesn't. But if I was him, I'd be like, bro, if I don't do this, they gonna kill me either way. So, you know what I mean? Oh, he controls his dolls. I'm not kind of surprised. Because dolls, dolls are some like crazy. I'm not surprised. He was supposed to making dolls. And bro had his his dogs as his magic, so I guess his dogs could be the same thing. I mean, I I'm, I'm not gonna compare the strength though. His shit might be on some hella strong shit. <laughs> Damn, the dog came different. Okay, okay, okay. Shit. Shit! <laughs> to be honest, it's an unpleasant job. I mean, this nigga look like he take this job for real, for real. You won't. God damn! <laughs> Sheesh! He said, put your head down. Oh! That shit crazy. Why did you come here to do this? You better put up with a real answer. Because he really doesn't have a reason, you know what I mean? We, we, we really don't see that much motivation. His grandpa died quick.
hey, this is something that I could deal with. And the moment I stop, I think. He's talking about running away, though. He's gonna, he's gonna accept the kid. At the same time, I don't know. I still don't know where the story's gonna go. But he, this nigga talked about running away. Like I expect some shit like that, bro. I really do. Read some manga, do your shit. At, at least you know that nigga's gonna be chilling. You know what I mean? And Sukuna is absorbed in you. But at the same time, Sukuna just being absorbed in you isn't gonna be something that's just gonna be containing itself, just chilling. That shit is bound to try to take over your body. God damn. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Now we have you. Oh, we see. Yeah, he wants to find out his body. I feel like that Sakuna's gonna want to find out his body. I say, but I already don't know how it's gonna go. It's an interesting story. I like how it's coming. Like I love it. That's all I can say for right now because it's two ways it could go. Like, I, I'm thinking, what if this nigga Itadoni allied up with Sukuna? Because Sukuna gonna have to probably think about shit like that. If Itadoni dies, he dies. If he wants to survive, team up with the nigga. We have a chill life because he can control you. Who's this? I feel like we're finding a new character reveal. Actually, they did show in the OP. I was like, who the hell is this? But who the hell is this? And this is the ending. I remember they saying, yeah, I watched this ending right now. This shit was also fire. But shit, uh, all right, I guess that was the episode two of Jutsu Kaisen. The, the, uh, the beginning came super heat. Loved it. I like this anime. I like where it's going because it's like Itadori. There's two ways you could go. There's multiple ways you could go. You could ally it with Sukuna. And you know what I mean? If they really come down to trying to kill you, like, ally up and get further and do you live your life. Like, they're not going to track you if you're not really killing people. Like, they're bound to just let you go. But at the same time, we don't know how this shit going to go because Sukuna might actually have to, might really be stronger and overwhelm this dude and take over his body. And it's going to be like, all right, we're trying to kill you now. And he might just lose control over his body for a long time. I don't know where this is going to go. It's going to be a good crazy roller coaster. That's all I'm saying, y'all. So if y'all like this shit, hit that like button. Let me know y'all ideas in the comment section. Especially if you're not a manga reader. You know what I mean? I like to see those blind like, ideas and shit like that. It's like, hey, that could possibly happen. It's a random idea. That's crazy. So I like seeing those in the comment section below. Let me know what y'all think. And you guys already know. I'll see y'all in the next video. Like, y'all. Peace.